Hello viewers, the Prime Minister Youth Camp in the Border Area Walong 2024 is an idea to empower the youths on various levels under the directives of PM Narendra Modi. To execute the idea, to curate the entire uh, program on ground level for uninterrupted five days, uh, there is always a person behind the curtain. Yes, I'm talking about Sri L. Sokun Singh, who is the Youth Welfare um, Officer, Directorate of Secondary Education Government of Arunachal Pradesh, Itanagar, who is also the founder of Taekwondo in Arunachal Pradesh. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Mm. Sir, um, it's the closing ceremony of the second edition of the youth camp and uh, in fact the first edition has been um, held uh, in Mechuka. Would you like to give a brief on this? Uh, yeah, it is the same thing. Uh, last time we have conducted in Mechuka and that was concluded very, you know, uh, very nicely and this time also we have conducted for five days and the similar activities uh, has been carried out mm. and all the children has been uh, benefited mm. and uh, in, in future also we are going to conduct the mm. similar things and maybe from the next time we will include some more uh, events mm. uh, to make uh, you know and, 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 and also the uh, participants will be more mm. since we have uh, two new uh, districts so mm. participants also will be more mm. and we are also trying to include some more activities uh, in this camp okay. uh, so conduct uh, conducting such an event is not a job you know handling hundreds of students from various districts how satisfied are you you know the way uh, this event has turned out uh, in fact yes uh, it, it's very tough and uh, you know challenging task mm. for us uh, but still uh, we have uh, expert uh, in our uh, department mm. and the we have very good uh, organizing committee and also we have bought a lot of support from the teachers uh, who are coming with the uh, students as scored uh, so of course there was uh, so many uh, you know shortcoming but uh, issues and all but we, we we have resolved everything in time mm. and there was no any un uh, uh, and to, uh, I mean, uh, unwanted incidents happen, and uh, as this time uh, one additional uh, uh, event was, uh, you know, uh, tracking in the midnight uh, to to the um, Dong sunrise uh, spot. Uh, so we have uh, gone there, uh, and that was additional, and that was, uh, I mean, I must say that that was one of the um, main attractive uh, event. And uh, uh, see, this is of course uh, for the empowering of the youths. The education uh, classroom teaching is not everything. So, uh, what we uh, felt is like the children are to be, you know, socially educated, and they are to be educated in different fields, not only the classroom teaching. So that is what uh, we see in this camp. We have varieties of uh, events for them like uh, see uh, mm, one day army life includes the you know uh, rock climbing tracking uh, rifle shooting you know but uh, uh, arms demonstration unarmed fighting martial art uh, you know demonstration and mar martial art training uh, you know games and sports competitions literary activities so so many uh, uh, activities are there which is uh, uh, very much important for uh, making a youth to be a responsible citizen. Okay. Sir, um, talking about this youth camp, have you and your team thought about, you know, uh, the next location for, for the third edition of the youth camp? If yes, when and where? Uh, maximum of the uh, participants uh, prefer to be uh, conducted the next camp in Tawang, mm. but uh, it is not final. We will put up some two, three locations to the government and uh, the final locations will be decided by the uh, competent authority. Mm. And sir, lastly, any message uh, you know, for, the, um, for the students and for the, your entire team of this uh, Prime Minister Youth Camp? Yes, uh, my message to all the participants mm. is to spread the uh, importance of this uh, Prime Minister Youth Camp. Mm. And, uh, 
to the officials also to uh, spread this uh, the the importance of this youth camp so that more and more children can uh, you know uh, be participated or benefited through or through uh, through the camp or uh, uh, through the person who has already attended the camp so uh, participating uh, in this camp uh, is uh, restricted uh, it, it it involved the huge financial expenditure so may not be possible for everyone to participate but uh, to participate in this uh, camp uh, a simple student cannot participate the par uh, the, the student has to be uh, you know fit and fine uh, discipline then only they will be able to take part in this uh, camp Yes. 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 जो गलतियाँ हुआ है जो गलतियाँ हुआ है कुछ कहीं कहीं में शॉर्टकमिंग हुआ है मिसकम्युनिकेशन वगैरह जो हुआ है वो हम उसमें इतना ह्यूज मिसकम्युनिकेशन नहीं हुआ कुछ ह्यूज प्रॉब्लम नहीं हुआ है छोटा मोटा जो हुआ है वो भी नेक्स्ट टाइम से नहीं होगा ये मेरा विश्वास है क्योंकि करेक्टिव मेजर विल बी टेकन के टेकन अप एंड टाइम टू टाइम यू नो कंसल्टेटिव मीटिंग विल बी कंडक्टेड एंड बिफोर वी गो फॉर दी फाइनल ऑर्गेनाइजिंग बिफोर फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दी फाइनल कमिटी फॉर ऑर्गेनाइजिंग दी नेक्स्ट कैम्प uh we will include more expert and then now we came to know many uh, many teachers are also having good uh, experience uh, for organizing of such camp so they will be also call uh, from our uh, directorate and during the consultative meeting they will be invited and uh, uh, i think we will have a very fruitful uh, discussion so that we can have a holistic and uh, you know very beautiful uh, system uh, systematization uh i mean systematic uh, program of the uh, next camp